Hey there, collectives, and welcome back for another Sweet Timber General Collective reading for love and everything in between. Shout out to you beautiful, amazing souls. Thank you so much for returning to this channel. If my vibe resonates with your soul, then please like, share, and subscribe. Also, I am still offering a pre-fall special where you can get two questions answered for $10 or a 30-minute personal reading for $30. You can email me for further descriptions or further information here. Also, don't forget to check out Outer Spirit. They still have a beautiful, phenomenal sale, as they always do. If you want the highest quality of crystal gemstones, authentic crystals, then check out Outer Spirit. And you can use my discount code BROWNEYES20 to receive a 20% off discount. So this is your collective energy today, collective. It is GRIND. I feel like somebody is so busy working or somebody is so busy making sure the bills are paid that they're forgetting about their love life because your next card is talking about choose love. So I feel like it could be you. It could be somebody you're dealing with. You could be dealing with a materialistic person or a person that's focused more on money than love. Somebody may feel like they can't have it all. You know, sometimes people feel like love is a distraction, you know, when they're on their grind. So I feel like either it is you, this is earth energy. It says skill development, mastery requires uh, repetition and rhythm. This is not about burning yourself out or doing busy work. Practice, focus, and determination will ground divine inspiration into something tangible. This card means that what you are pursuing requires ritual, regular commitment, and a little by little approach. But somebody I feel like is focusing all of their energy on their grind instead of looking at the big picture here. Somebody trying to get somebody's attention here. Somebody probably sending somebody pictures and, you know, flirting with them through text messages and somebody ignoring them because they feel like they ain't got time. You're a weak girl and I don't have time on the weekday. You a weekend girl, a boy. And all this time you got love all around you. So spirit is telling someone you can, spirit say don't uh, burn yourself out chasing the almighty dollar because you need to stay balanced with love because it is here. Ace of Cups, someone is not wanting to change. Death in the reverse, but they still keep on getting the same results and they go to Ten of Pentacles in the reverse. Could be a Scorpio, Earth sign here. Choose love, but somebody's on that old mighty grind here. Somebody say, "Um, money can't buy me love." Well, somebody say that love don't pay the bills, and somebody say that money can't buy love. Somebody's gonna be regretting this, or somebody is regretting it. You could be dealing with somebody here with somebody uh did not um. Uh, Somebody was chasing the material world and they didn't have time for love and somebody's regretting that they did not choose this. So someone may be seeming like they're in a dark place right now, but things could possibly turn around because you do have the sun card, Leo energy, Scorpio energy, earth energy. What is this grind energy for the collective today, spirit? What is this about? See? Five of Pentacles. Somebody's stuck on the money. Somebody feels like that they... I feel like somebody may be trying to work themselves out of debt. But this is someone here who is... Somebody may have other obligations. I feel like someone regrets not choosing this connection because somebody, somebody may feel like they don't have... Somebody may feel like they're not good enough for you. You got the nine of cups in reverse. It's almost like somebody feels like that, that your standards is too high or that you're used to a certain type of lifestyle. And so for some for somebody, somebody is, is avoiding you or not doing right by this connection because they don't feel like they're good enough for you. So for some of you feminists, some of y'all could be requiring much. You know, they, somebody could be looking at you like you're too high maintenance. And they can't afford you. Somebody feel like they can't afford you, collective. Somebody said that they, they can't offer you the finest things. Somebody said that you probably used to having this. Somebody may see you look, look, looking good, smelling good, driving the best. Somebody may see you abundant and it intimidates them. Could be a Libra, 
a Leo or a Scorpio or a Taurus, Virgo or Capricorn. Somebody could be grinding harder just to get somebody's attention. Somebody may be doing extra stuff to impress you. Somebody feels like somebody could re be regretting not choosing you instead of their career and now you didn't outgrow grew them and you're no longer interested. Y'all yeah, know most of these people are materialistic. Now we're not we're not foolish. We know what it requires to maintain, but everything has to be in moderation and in balance. Because if not, you're gonna you're gonna lose focus on the bigger picture and only focus on a temporary gratification. Now somebody may be trying to set up, you know, generational wealth. See, and they go that five of pentacles again, but they're not feeling this. So why is this five of cups here for the collectives? Who is feeling this regret? Could be a Cancer, Scorpio, or Pisces. Someone feeling like they done lost out. Somebody's going back and, and, and reminiscing and realizing that all the time that they put in on their work or whatever, they lost, they may have lost love. So why is the Five of Cups here? See, King of Wands. See, somebody probably like looking good, flexing and feeling good, but look, look how they really feel. Insecure. See, somebody feel like I feel like somebody feels like you're out of their league. See, Knight of Pentacles, Four of Wands, and there go that Empress, and there go the Magician. Somebody feels like you're out of their league collective. Could be a fire sign. See, because there go that Empress again. Or someone could be feeling bad because they took too long to, you know, snatch you up when they had a chance. And now you may be looking like you're good, you know, on your own or you, you know, you're glowing or maybe look for somebody. Somebody has a lot of regret because somebody finding out that they took too long offering you something and you got somebody else child you can. So they already know <laughs> it's over. <laughs> Somebody, somebody regretting not putting that baby in use because somebody else probably, you know what I'm saying? Mm. So why is death in the reverse? Somebody may be having a hard time letting this go. Because you got the five of cups. Could be a Scorpio. Why is death in the reverse? See? Pop that again. Ace of cups. See? Either someone is, somebody feels like, see? They go that Ten of Pentacles again, see? Somebody say they deserve this. This is what they get. Somebody may be looking. See, th this is something that they could have had with you if they wasn't so insecure, if they wasn't playing games or listening to their ego. Somebody may be seeing you as abundant and with that justice in the reverse. I feel like somebody feels like this is their karma. Somebody know that ain't no way in the world you will want to be with them now because y'all, some of y'all doing better. For some of y'all, somebody is witnessing you get everything in another relationship that they could have gave you if they wasn't so selfish. This is a hard pill to swallow for someone. For others, you intimidate this person because they feel like you bougie and you, you're wealthy and, and they can't compare or they can't keep up. Could be a Libra, Scorpio, Leo. See, page of cups, somebody regret this. Wow. I just heard if I could turn back the hands of time, but you can't. So why is the five of pentacles here? Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn, you got the grind. Nine of cups. Someone may have not budgeted their money right. I'm getting the energy that somebody likes to look good. But I feel like somebody wants to come back in. 
Somebody may be hoping, somebody may be finally deciding to come back in and try to offer you something here. They go to Ace of Pentacles, but they go to King of Swords in the reverse. Somebody could be lying to themselves. Somebody may not want to accept accountability that they lost you because they know that they was all about their ego and all about the material world. And then they may have fallen off because they needed to learn a lesson or they do a lot of reckless spending. And now they have fallen off and now they see you growing with someone else or on your own. See, because they go to Seven of Pentacles, see? They go to Queen of Cups. Somebody feels like <laughs> you may not want them no more. Because they didn't make you a priority when they should have. They, they could have balanced it all out and gave a little bit of energy to everything. But instead of that, now they was only focusing on what they wanted. They go to Devil Card, Capricorn, see? Somebody was addicted to money, addicted to the image until it all came crumbling down. And not only that, somebody's realizing that they love you when it's too late, see? Because they're going to judge me, see? Now someone is having to go back down memory lane and remember everything that they did not offer you. Ooh. Why is the Ten of Pentacles in the reverse for the collective in this grind and choose love? Ten of Pentacles in the reverse. Somebody may be having to see you. Somebody's karma could see that you get everything that they did not give you because they was all about their own selfish needs. Somebody may be, look, ooh, ooh, that's what I feel like is going to happen too because look, that go to emperor. Now that go to freaking emperor. Where he come from? I feel like somebody's going to regret because I feel like somebody else is going to show somebody up. And then for some of y'all, let's see, you could be the same person growing up and maturing and gaining wisdom after the fact or someone. It could also represent somebody's trying to act like there is not affecting them. Somebody is lying to themselves. See, someone is in denial that they lost something abundant here. This is why things are not coming together for this person because they somebody's got a lot of pride. See, this is why they're not able to move on. Because they lying to themselves, trying to act like you wasn't worth it all. And once again, somebody losing money. Somebody, somebody's being taught a lesson here. And I feel like the reason why they're being taught a lesson is because somebody was very, very prideful, egotistical. Somebody felt like it, they didn't need love because they had all of the money. So they would decide to just focus nothing but on their grind. And I feel like spirit them answers kept on telling this person, you better choose love. This person could have been looking at your picture, but, you know, not taking action or person blocking you out, trying to act like you don't matter when the whole time you matter now. So what's up with this empress? Now, one more card for the Ten of Pentacles in the reverse. Someone here could have had an addiction of some sort, but like it was an addiction to money, to ego, to power. Someone didn't have time for little old love. See? This person ain't doing so well. See, Ace of Wands. See, they've been deflated. All of their pride is gone. See? <laughs> so I feel like these masculines are being humble once again because they, you know, arrogant. They keep on putting down the feminines here. You know what I'm saying? It's all about their money. It's all about their image. And they don't have time for love until they don't have nothing. And then they're going to be wanting their love. So why sun in the reverse? Leo energy. It's somebody's, these masculines are in a dark place right now, but they're going to have to pick themselves up because the empress ain't here to save them no more, see? Because whatever somebody was giving them, they're not giving anymore. Somebody say, you don't deserve this, and see? That's why they feeling this type of way, and they go that five of cups again. And once again, because see, they ain't learned no lessons. Even though they're crushed on the inside, they still trying to act like they are okay that you are gone, but they're not. Somebody's trying to keep from breaking down, and somebody keep on trying to keep up the image that they are okay, although they lose and it. See? <laughs> Oh, this could be a baby mama, baby daddy situation. And 
your baby daddy was all out here in these streets flexing like they had and they probably had the money once upon a time but they wasn't doing right by you so they losing everything and 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 what they realized that all that money didn't mean nothing because they ain't got you ace of cups what's up with this ace of cups now why is this nine of cups in the reverse i feel like there was a lot of overspending a lot of ego tripping a lot of um toxic behavior why is the nine of cups here for the collective in the reverse why is this here See, see, somebody ain't getting old. Somebody ain't being replenished no more. And they're stuck on this. See, things done turned around on them. Two of swords here. Knight of Wands. Someone's not going to overlook somebody's bad deeds or, or in, in consideration. Because see, see that the t tables have turned on somebody. Somebody messed around and the tables done turned on them. And now somebody's finna get a whole bunch of abundance while somebody's got to go through a season of lack. And that's humbling them. Somebody was walking around here in that big D energy. They ain't gonna walk around there like that now. Somebody, it's almost like somebody doing a complete fall off. Somebody car probably and fell apart, getting repossessed with the Ten of Pentacles in the reverse. This is when stunting goes horribly wrong. Ace of Cups, why is the Ace of Cups here for the collective? It could represent, you got the Ace of Cups here twice. Somebody could have had some babies and somebody was not putting them babies first. You know, rather buy a nice looking car, rather look like something. See? Four of Cups, Four of Pentacles, I feel like somebody was selfish. Somebody was very, very selfish because somebody wanted to be out here with everybody else. Seven of Cups. It's like somebody was tending to everybody else's yard instead of their own and they end up losing everything. See there? You can't walk on nobody and think you're going to live happily ever after. You plant seeds. So someone is being humbled in the worst kind of way. Queen of Wands. Somebody may have gotten unexpectedly gotten, you know, a child, six of wands. I feel like somebody didn't want to commit, but I feel like someone wanted the benefits of this relationship. It could have even produced a child that somebody here did not acknowledge. And now they're losing everything. I write the Empress. Because that Empress is standing tall with that Ten of Pentacles and Ace of Cups. Then you got Justice in the reverse. So somebody's definitely receiving karma. You got Judgment, the Tower Car, all of that. They getting it all. What's up with this Empress? Death. Oof. You remember you got the death in the reverse up there? See, I feel like the Empress is going through a major transformation. That's why the Empress has moved on, because she knows what she deserved. Ten of Swords. She's like, uh-uh. See there? Now, now somebody's watching you because I feel like somebody's, is hitting, the, somebody's hit, hitting rock bottom because this is humbling season, and the only one they can think about is you. Somebody feel like they getting all this karmas because they know they did you wrong. See, ain't that something they should be thinking about their happy life, right? Now they thinking about you because somebody know they, they didn't do right. Two of cups. Somebody may have to witness. Somebody may be witnessing you go on and live a happily ever after abundant, successful, a, a wealthy life with somebody else. I feel like this is an arrogant child's father or masculine. Two of cups. See. I feel like what's going to end up happening is you're going to end up getting it with somebody else and somebody's going to live to regret it. See? See that? Somebody was avoiding a commitment. Someone was avoid doing the right thing. But guess what? You're going to get it anyway, but it ain't going to be with them and they're going to have to witness it because once again, the tables are turning. The tables are turning back in your favor because this person was trying to act like they was the man, but they weren't looking for nothing serious. And this is the same person who's trying to act like they're not being affected by karma, but their whole life is showing it. All right. They, they, they ain't the almighty emperor no more with that ace of wands and the nine of pentacles in the reverse. OK, this person going to see other people support you in something new. Why they going to have to stand on the background and look in. See? 
this is somebody here going to be telling everybody that, that they once knew you before because somebody's about to live in a whole luxurious life with a wealthy connection here and somebody finna lead this arrogant person but this is their karma for somebody your, your your person's karma is to see you wealthy and in love and happily married or in a committed relationship with someone else and this is their karma because they're going to be on the outside looking in for some of y'all, you may have gotten pregnant by this person and they denied you. Now they're going to see somebody else take care of their baby. And there ain't going to be nothing they can do about it but just look and just cry. Somebody going to be crying. <laughs> they, but they ain't going to let the world know. But when they buy they said, please believe, they're crying because somebody's life has went from bad to worse messing over you. So that's your today's message collective in this sweet timber energy. So please like, share, and subscribe.